if you answer my questions correctly, your team will receive points. But if you don't get the questions correct, who gets the points? Yeah. Me. Now, because I work here, I'm going to be the home team. And because you are all visiting us today, you get to be the guest team. So, let's have a little pep rally to start things out. Let's hear it for the home team. So this 
bigger, it's a little softer, it's a, what is it? Softball. And Emma, what kind of ball is this? Is this a grapefruit ball? Yeah, it looks like it. How does it feel? Is it lighter or is it heavy? It's heavy. That's right. It weighs about 16 pounds. Big men and women. See how it's a, what is it? Shot foot. That's right. Let's see how far they can throw it or put it. This is a shot foot. Now, actually this is an indoor shot foot. Uh, this is meant for indoor uses because an outdoor shot foot is a, about the size of a softball. It's made of solid metal, but this is used for indoor use. Now, Emma, for five points, which ball is going to bounce higher? And well, what question should you ask first? What surface? Do you want to know what surface we're going to use? Mm -hmm. We're going to use the wood surface. So, do you still pick the softball? You think the softball's going to bounce higher? You don't? Well, you should probably think. You, you think so? Don't listen. Okay, you think softball. Who agrees with Emma? Who thinks softball's going to bounce higher? Who thinks softball? All right, good. Well, Emma, go ahead and take this ball. Stand right next to me. Hold it right out like this. If the softball bounces higher, your team gets five points. Ready? One, two, three. Which one bounced higher? Oh, no. The softball did. Yes, team. Five points for the guest team. All right. Ooh, you folks are catching up. I still have the lead. Now, was that pretty easy, Emma? That was a pretty easy question. For ten points now, I want you to tell me how can we make the shot put bounce higher than the softball? What do you think, Emma? Drop it on the brick. Who agrees with Emma? Who thinks we should drop it on the brick? All right, let's find out. Now, Emma, you take the softball. We need to be careful this time. Go ahead and pull the softball out. And get a little closer. And go ahead and drop it. Yeah, it bounced pretty good. It bounced right about to there. Now, if this shot foot bounces higher, your team gets 10 points. Stand back. I don't want this to jump it up and hit you. So stand right. Left. There you go. Good. Ready?
lower. And what happens is, what's on the inside of a racquetball? There is, it's not solid rubber, there's air on the inside. And when air gets cold, the molecules slow down, they begin to contract or get smaller. So with the cold ball, it's almost like we've taken some of the air out of it, so it has less elasticity. Now when air gets warm, it doesn't contract, it does what it gets.
40 points in the game.